Good afternoon, guys. So I just finished watching episode three of Assassination Classroom season two. And the pacing on this anime on season two is great. Things are moving along. Um, characters are being developed. Um, it, it's, it's, um, it's going really, really, really good. It's super enjoyable. Um, we have a new classmate. We finally have Itona in the class. Uh, you know, Mr. Tentacle Boy that wanted to kill Koro Sensei, you know. Brothers, Aniki type shit. Well, he's part of the classroom again. He sees that the Shiro, uh, I think his name is Shiro, uh, the guy that's been manipulating him and all this bullshit, um, he's just been manipulated. He's just a tool. And um, he saw in this episode that he's more than that, that he can get, get friends, that he will kill Koro Sensei one day or try to. And it was great the character development for Itona. I don't know if we're going to get some more Itona like we got him at this episode. Uh, I don't know. I don't read the manga. Some of you, some of you guys probably do. Um, let, don't spoil it for me because I'm taking this episode by episode. But this was a very fun episode. We see how much Koro Sensei actually cares about his, his students. How he would f do anything for them and when he sets his mind to it. When, once he considers you his student, he will teach you. And that is annoying, but it's really cool. Um, we have yet to see other fan favorites yet to come out. For example, Karma. Karma's a big fan favorite for me, the like little kid with the red hair. I haven't seen him do anything cool yet. Um, a couple other, I feel the same way about a couple other classmates. But other than that, it was a good episode. The plot is continuing at a great pace um and we'll see where episode four goes um new classmate no more tentacles it's uh it's good uh music in this anime was awesome it, it hit the spot the animation again always great with assassination classroom and we'll see how episode four goes i mean that's all that really happened in episode three uh, was character development for Itona, um, him realizing the truth, and then getting a new classmate. He did end up in Terasaka's group, which is kind of weird. I wouldn't have wanted him to end up in that group of classmates. Um, I'm not a big uh, Terasaka fan, but I mean, we'll see, right? So you guys have a good one. Like and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think of this anime or this episode. If you guys want me to review anything else, let me know. So, you guys have a good one.